the link between uh, Elon and China is not based on communism. You can look at, actually, you can look at Musk himself and ask the question, is, is Elon Musk somehow a communist himself? Well, he's the richest man in the world right now. He, he regained his title that he lost temporarily. <laughs> he's now back on top. He, he shows no signs, no ideology of being a communist per se. He's a technocrat. We've talked about this a lot. And uh, you, you will remember that his grandfather, uh, Joshua Haldeman, was in charge of the technocrat movement in Canada during the 30s and 40s. And this, is, uh, this is the home that, uh, that Elon grew up in. Uh, they migrated to South Africa after they got tired, I guess, of, of Canada. But um, he, he's a technocrat through and through. He's a transhumanist, too. Totally died in the wool transhumanist, trying to escape death, working as hard as he can, spending his money trying to escape death. And the reason that there is a camaraderie between him and the people in China is that the, all of them are technocrats. And I have to say, birds of a feather flock together. These people are, are in a sense, they're blood brothers. They're, they're technocrats. They think like technocrats. Most of the head uh, or the top people in China right now have advanced engineering degrees and science degrees. That's a natural, uh, absolute natural for, for Elon Musk because you know his engineering brain and stuff, whatever. I mean, these, these people get along like brothers. So there's no there's no conflict there. There never has been. There's lots of other people in Silicon Valley the same way. They move back and forth. You know, uh, Apple has moved back and forth between the U.S. and China multiple times in the last 20 years. Um, the friendship they have is based on technocracy. It's not based on communism. But we can see this clearly with Elon Musk. I mean, they welcomed him with open arms. Oh, my gosh, they love this guy. 16-course meal they served him. I don't know how a little guy like that can eat 16 courses of anything, but imagine, incredible. <laughs> yeah, it is.